What's going on guys? Falcon Punch bringing you back to more Tales of Zestria. Let me double check the audio real quick. Okay, audio seems alright. Anyway, um, you may notice that the game feels a little bit smoother. Uh, reason being is that, or not seems smoother, it might feel a little bit faster. It might be a little bit off-putting in fact. But the reason for this is because I applied the 60 FPS patch that you can find on Steam the in the community hub but I waited for a bit to see if there would be any more bugs but it seems like it's going okay but if something does end up fucking up in the later on well we'll just deal with it as it comes and just uninstall whatever we installed uh, okay so I learned that the car knows Morocco's power let's meet her okay so we're supposed to go to the Knight's Tower. Uh... Okay. Mm. But basically what I ended up doing was I said our gameplay like on the map and then in the battle as what is it? How should I say it? Um, as 60 FPS and everything else, like cutscenes, to be thrown in as 30 FPS. So I'm hoping everything you know ends up working out okay. At least I hope it will. Hopefully it does. Pop a bin here. Okay. Eh, but yeah. Um, holy crap, that moves so fast at 60 FPS. <laughs> uh, I don't know if that's a good thing or not. Shit. Earth and Gale. I'll throw it on this one. God, everything just seems just quick, right? <laughs> Anyways, uh, you guys might be wondering why. Why has Falcon Punch, you know, forsaken us in terms of uploading videos? Well, I lost a lot of motivation, honestly. It was just like, I could upload this now, but at the same time, it's like, hmm. I just didn't really feel like recording and if I don't feel like recording that means the recording if I force it will just end up being really bad Wallace? and I'm not about you know giving a bad viewing experience to my viewers just want it to be nice relaxing calming and at the same time very smooth would be the word, I guess. Just want you to enjoy the game with me. And at the time, until like just now, I was just very. How should I say this? Like, I just didn't. I just didn't feel like it. Like, if I don't feel like it, then I'm not gonna do it. But today. I'm really in the mood. Maybe it's because I'm not working. <laughs> Maybe because I'm not doing anything for uh, any other shit. Because, um. The fact that I'm not working at all right now means that I have just plenty of time to do whatever I feel like it. Oh, I didn't want to actually equip that right there. Okay, I'll just equip that now for her. Ooh, slow ward. I don't really care about that right now. Peach gel. Get like five of those. 
holy bottles or no Why are those sealed? I don't understand. Oh, I don't have any of this shit for it. Okay. Uh-huh. Okay. Melancholic then I think that's fine for now with that shit. And then black talismans. Calcite. What else? I have honestly no idea what I'm doing when it comes to fusing this shit, so hopefully it all works out. But if it doesn't, then we're screwed. That should be okay. Yeah, it should be fine. Oh god, the game feels so much smoother at 60 FPS. Ooh, I love it. Hopefully you guys enjoy it as well. Uh, let me double check over here and make sure nothing's missing from our gathering log. <laughs> but yeah, uh, just... Today I just felt like recording for some reason just hit me. I was like, you know what? I'm going to do this. Might as well, seeing as... Am I going the wrong way? Oh, I am going the wrong way. But I was like, might as well, seeing as, you know, people have been waiting, you know. It's not nice to keep them wondering what the hell's going on. And... At the same time, I need to finish this game. Oh. I have this on monitor capture. So it shows the other people on my Steam's friend list. Uh, I should fix that. But actually, it's not that important, right? It's fine. You guys can see what other people are playing. Okay. Uh, where to go? Where to go? Where to go? Oh, let's check down here first then. Or up here, I mean. Because it seems to lead nowhere that I can enter. So that must mean there must be something that I can get, right? Right? Right. Nothing. I hate you. There really is nothing. What the f- Okay. It's alright. I believe... Fuck, this whole game just looks completely different. When it's running at a reasonable frame, la uh, frame rate. Ugh. Might as well check in here too and be disappointed. <laughs> oh! So while I've been on like basic hiatus from YouTube, I have been doing a lot more Final Fantasy. And by that, I've been grinding my relic. Been working on god damn it been <laughs> working on savage and my group euphoric lightning that we've been working that i uh, that i've been working with for the longest time now 
We've finally completed A1S. Alexander won Savage before the nerf, which I'm pretty happy about. I'd rather not, you know, have to deal with, or not deal with, but have to play nerfed content. Having content, you know, at its most difficult still, and completing it felt really fucking good. And I'll probably upload the highlight to that very soon. Oh god. I was so happy. <laughs> so very, very happy. Okay. This is the Knight's Tower, so I guess this is the right place to go. This should be a better place to talk. Did everything go okay? Can we get in the church? I secured the permissions, but after that last incident, I'm afraid we're likely under high scrutiny. So what else is new? They weren't big fans of us in the first place. Yeah, good point. We've got nothing to hide. Let's do it. Look at that. Ever since Rose joined up with us, I feel like Saray has become so much more proactive. Too bad it means that much more trouble for us. Thank you. It was my decision to begin with. And besides, I've really wanted to see the shrine inside the church. There's something about you that reminds me of the Pope. He too would never hesitate to spare expenses for the sake of his people. Oh boy, another masochist. I see. I've prepared lodgings for you. I pray that the Seraphim will also be able to rest well tonight. But Captain, it's been three days since last we heard from Boris after his infiltration. I believe we should hurry. Who's Boris? Yeah. The rain may be affecting our food supplies, but I shall prepare our famous Drago stew for you. Aren't you the least bit concerned? He's your only brother. I do not wish to burden you with my troubles any more than I already have. Please rest for now. It's a kind offer. Let's take it. We will. Thank you. Hmm. So it's his younger twin. Okay. They're missing, huh? Fuck you too then, bitch. George held off. Hey, isn't this the guy from the Earth in Historia? The first captain of the Platinum Knights, General Georg Heldolf. Heldolf! And this was painted over 20 years ago. He would definitely show up in the Earth in Historia. So this is Heldolf. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, so I just go back to the inn. That's kind of lame. Sergey sure seems like a good guy. He is, though I fear he may be a bit too genuine and sincere to command the knights. I agree. I hope he has what it takes. We've got plenty of worries of our own. Let's not get hung up on other people's issues. Okie dokie. Huh. Can I move? Okay. Mm, fortunes, eh? Huge fortunes, you say? Oh, look, it's cats. Or turtles. Hmm. 
Are we related? Okay. And it's so nice. Just, it feels like I'm moving at a faster pace, which I kind of am. But there's just a big difference to it, too. You're going to have this little nook and cranny that I can't get anything from. Okay, game. Hmm. Let's talk with more people and see what we can use we can gather. for a fucking year? That sucks. Okay. Ruins talks. Not that big of a deal. Ooh, treasure chest. You know what this game kind of reminds me of as far as with the people talking like this? It reminds me of Dot Hack. GU. I don't know if anyone else has played that game, but if you haven't, you definitely should. It's a great video game. Phew. Now that was a meal. Uh. Hey, learn some manners. You sure can eat. So can these two. It was surprisingly good. I couldn't help myself. Drago stew. 85 points. My policy is eat while you can. It's been ingrained in me since I was a kid. That's the law of a soldier. Hmm. A soldier, huh? Soldier? Aren't you and your buddies in an assassin's guild? Well, you know, it wasn't always like this. We used to be just a band of mercenaries. Not to brag, but they called us the best on the continent. Is that right? <sighs> That's it for me. We've got a job to do tomorrow. Is Rose's band of mercenaries the one you mentioned before? The Wind Riders, I believe. I think I've heard of them. The tale said just a hundred of them could scatter a force of 20,000 men and capture three castles in one night. Yeah, they were a legendary band of mercenaries. It's no wonder Rollins itself was their primary employer. They sound crazy strong. Strong and loyal. To the point that even the Emperor of Rollins trusted them like his right-hand man. Isn't that right? It's true. Was true. But then, the Imperial family of Rollins ended up stabbing them in the back. Along with the very one I'm seeking vengeance against. Vengeance! The Imperial family joined forces with Hellions? Is it that surprising? I guess not. People and Hellions aren't separate entities, after all. Very true. You can even consider them two sides of the same coin. In fact, if the Cardinal's power is somehow linked to a Hellion, things start to make sense. It looks like Rose snuck out through the back. I can't take my eyes off her for a second. Hey, Dazzle! I wonder if someone ordered an assassination. Who? And was she asked to do it by herself? Either way, this is bad. Okay, how do I get over there? Oh. Can I do that little wind step? No? Oh, Dezel's not with me, so I can't. Lame. Look at how fast I move. Woo! -hoo! I'm like Sonic. What's wrong? Why are you all here? That's what we want to know. Where were you going? Oh, just taking a walk. Thought maybe I ate too much. 
You don't have to follow every whim that pops into your head, damn it. We thought you might have ditched us to go assassinate someone. Not yet, silly. That comes later. <laughs> it's from someone who lost their son in the war that just broke out. Kill the one who started the battle. The invasion was proposed to the Emperor about a year ago, in documents bearing the name of Pope Misedra. Huh? You're gonna kill the Pope? Hold on. How do you know someone didn't just use his name? I thought he went missing after all. Maybe. But then again, maybe not. It's awfully close to the time he went missing. We'll have to investigate further. And what if we find out that he's bad? If it's evil? The scattered bones slay it. Even if it's the Pope? The Pope, the Emperor, even the Shepherd. Oh, was that inappropriate? <laughs> I'm not a fan of that last part, it's true. It isn't like we walk around all stabby stabby. We make sure what kind of person our target is first. Is she giving like foreshadowing that she's gonna try and kill us? Rose. Do you know? Well, that's good. I'm starting to understand too why she bears no malevolence, that is. Because she's as nuts as he is? <laughs> Rose would certainly never tell a lie, that's for sure. She was always that way, it's in her blood. Was the Pope the type of person who would just up and start a war? That's certainly not the impression of him we got from Sergei. He's the de facto leader of a powerful country. He's probably got more layers than you'd think. I kind of want to go fight something. In fact, that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to go fight something. I'm, I want to see how the 60 FPS feels in a fight before I get into like something serious. I think that's a good idea. Pretty sure it's a good idea. It's a great idea. What am I saying? I made it, or I thought of it, so it has to be great. <laughs> Can I? All right. Where are people to kill, or monsters and hellions and shit? I don't see any. I don't see any at all, actually. Well, this is awkward. Oh, there's a chest. Oh, there they are. Hey, that guy looks like he's not, you know, lagging like they normally are. Sharpened needle. Okay, time to fight. Feels nice. Ooh. The ruins are calling me. Yeah, definitely feels a lot nicer. Fight me. Exhaust yourself, Saray. All things in moderation, as they say. Okay. All right, we're good. I just wanted to see how it feels. Feels great. A lot smoother. But what the fuck? Skunks? Oh shit. Ow. 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 God damn it. What the fuck is hitting me? God damn skunks. Yeah. 
damn it. All right, we're good. I feel like the game looks better too. I don't know why. It just seems that way. It seems a lot brighter and nicer to just look at. I might be going insane. Who knows? Let me know in the comments if you think it does look better. Thank you. I know. I should take it on the road, right? <laughs> oh, jeez. Where is the shrine church? Did I somehow miss this? Where the fuck is it? Oh, is it that dungeon now? Is it a dungeon that I can go in? I think it is. Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. Oh yeah, while we do this, let's uh, change the fashion on Rose. Part of a night. I like that look on her. Go with that. Okay, should be good. We're going in. Well, that was easier than we thought. This looks like an auditorium of sorts for the believers. Sure looks like a small crowd. Huh. The reason why we're looking this way while we're moving is so we can see if there's anything to pick up. And there isn't. Great. I mean, not so great. <laughs> can you tell me the names of the Seraphim who hold the utmost power, known as the Five Lords? Correct. Now, can you tell me the name of the last one? The seraph who's worshipped here at the Shrine Church? Motelis! <gasps> That's right! Motelis is the seraph who has given the entire Glenwood continent his blessing. The seraph worshipped at the Shrine Church is Motelis? The five lords, huh? Big movers and shakers. I bet Mautelis would know something about how to stand against the Lord of Calamity. He's got to. Is he really all that? Well, he's the leader of the Five Lords, after all. You must be Soray. 
Welcome to the Roland's Church headquarters. I heard you were to visit. Please, come on in. Oh, that was the zipper to my hoodie. Sorry. Where'd that guy disappear to? Look at these fucking creepy little kids. Can I first person? No. I thought I could first person in this it's game. More magnificent than I'd even imagined. The architecture definitely dates it to the height of the era of Asgard. Glad to see you're impressed, but don't let your guard down. No. There's no... Discovery? That's weird. You would think there would be since it's such a big church in this giant empire, right? Uh, whatever. Save? Oh, no, I guess not. Oh, shit, sorry. Didn't mean to hit my pop filter. This inscription concerns the trial of the shepherd and the spiritual powers he obtains upon clearing it. Could the spiritual powers be real? Bzz, 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 bzz. Be real, real bees. Oh, bees everywhere. Just, Just possibly. possibly. <laughs> it's like the lettering's meant to tell us something. But it's all gibberish. It must be some kind of code. Well, it does involve sensitive info. Maybe there's a hint to crack the code somewhere. Hey, what does the big rock thing say? I'm afraid I'm not really sure. The inscription is written in some sort of cipher, and the key to interpreting it is handed down only from Pope to Pope. So, I guess we'll have to get the Pope to read it then, huh? The fuck is going on? Surrey. Something's wrong. Let's get out of here. I don't feel so good. What is going on? It's a Hellion's domain. Just like when we fought Helldolf. Kids turned to stone. But it's like they've been turned to stone. No shit. Who is that? Is that a girl? It's a woman. Going home already, Shepherd? <gasps> I am Cardinal Fortin of the Church of Rollins. It was a woman all along? This domain. Is it yours? Ah, so you can still move. No shit, I'm the shepherd, bitch. Why don't you lend me your powers? For the sake of the people, of course. They asked me the same thing in Highland. I hardly think myself the equal of a Philistine like Bartlow. Sounds like something a Philistine would say. Charming, but sticks and stones and so on, young lady. Ooh, her voice actress is nice. Ooh, she's good. I have but one wish. To see my empire overcome this tumultuous era of chaos. A task only possible if the people are united. Is her little thingy in the middle of her head supposed to light up? To unify the people through mere patriotism alone. Shepard. Do you know exactly what it is that the state has used for eons to keep an entire country in line? Is it... faith? Yes, faith. It is the belief in their own salvation that inspires in people the greatest sense of unity when they band together against outsiders who share different values. Meaning that my church itself should serve as the cornerstone for all of Roland's. Maybe in your mind. It is but the vision of one who would guide the people. With the name and power of the shepherd, more people than ever can be brought to salvation. Then you should cooperate with the knights. Wouldn't that really be what's best for everyone? 
I would welcome their efforts if they would simply bend to my will and do as I command. Even if they are a pack of loutish meatheads who can't figure out that their Pope abandoned them. Wait a minute, the Pope just ran away? You didn't have him locked up? I am not a street thug, child. The Pope, Macedra, I should say, left of his own accord. Abandoning his duty to both the Empire and his followers. What, pray tell, would you call such a man? Pretty irresponsible, if what you're saying is true. Irresponsible is one word, and still there are so many fools out there who trust in such a coward. The Knights, for example. In order to bring the people together, we must find Macedra and give him his due punishment. Punishment? Yes. The same punishment that befell those uncivil enough to mistrust me. Then we have a problem. We need the Pope to tell us the meaning of the inscription. Why? Cooperate with me and it won't be necessary. I need to know. No matter what. Ah, I see. That's very unfortunate. So then you mean to say... What the... My body! That you reject my vision! Saray! <sighs> Let's go! We're leaving. But I want to kick her butt. And since when could you guys disappear like that? Well, you are kind of slow. What? They broke through my domain and connected with the Seraphim, if only just for a moment. Oh, will I relish this! Okay, Maleficent. <laughs> we disappeared? What the hell was that? It's called the Spectral Cloak. <laughs> You've been practicing in secret, haven't you? That was sweet! We'll talk later. We've got to flee to the Knight's Tower. Okay. Ah. <laughs> Look at how funny he <laughs> Okay. Oh, look. Okay, to the nice tower. I'm going in. Got a dash. You go on ahead. Wait, what? No. Uh, okay. Pope fled of his own volition? I'm sorry I couldn't get more details. We were sort of running for our lives. No, that is more than enough. I'm just relieved that you weren't captured. Thanks for saving us back there. It's the least I could do. Seraph Miklio, my humble admiration for your bravery. Huh? It's nothing really. It is nothing. All you did was blind her temporarily. <laughs> we have to do something about her domain. Those powers might help. Let's get the Pope to decipher that inscription. How are we going to find him? That'll be tough if we don't know where he is. The Knights have been hunting him for a year now with no success. Yeah, but they were assuming the whole time that the Cardinal was behind the disappearance. Guess what? I think I know where Popadope might be. Popadope? You do? The village of Gadadin on the southern part of the continent. We won't know for sure until we check it out, of course. How did you get that information? Well, let's just call it an industry secret. 
You know how it is. Of course. I should have expected no less from the wife of the shepherd. <laughs> Let us send a search team to Gadon. I forgot that he still thinks we're husband and wife. The cardinal already expects that our side will be searching for the Pope. A highly visible squadron of knights would essentially be a bright pink arrow pointed straight at him. However, we can operate covertly in small numbers. Let Leave us it to us. Gadotin. But that's far too much to ask. Chill, Captain, we got this. What is it they say? Pope springs eternal? No. Abandon Pope, all ye who... Uh, don't go to Gadotin. <laughs> okay, settle down. My thanks, User gentle shepherd. Actually, as for what you can do in return, do you suppose we could get a pass to Rollins? Disconnected. Also connected to TeamSpeak. That was kind of embarrassing. Thank you. That's a load off my mind. There is something I would like to impart to you as well. Would you please step outside for a moment? Ah, oh, God. <laughs> What's that? that? Ooh. So this is the true face of the Lord of Calamity? For real? I don't know. He just looked like a big lion-headed hellion to us. But Lila said that the Earth and Historia would be the guidepost to lead us to the Lord of Calamity. And the human mentioned there was held off. It would make sense that they're one and the same. Huh. Yeah, I can see that. Hmm. Makes him look like a pretty distinguished gentleman, actually. Yeah. He looks maybe the same age as our dads, don't you think? Or at least, that's how old he was 20-ish years ago. Looks like he was the first captain of the Knights. To hang his portrait like this. He must command a lot of respect from Sergei and the rest of the knights. Saray, I'm okay. It just sank in for me. The Lord of Calamity isn't some faceless monster. He's a human being. Just like me. <laughs> mm. 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 Okay, let's go see what Sergei has to say outside. Do you remember the art I used when we fought against one another? That is the Lion's Howl, an art passed down through our band of knights. I and my younger brother Boris are the only ones alive who know it. But now I pass it to you as well. Wilt thou accept? <laughs> yes. Sure. <laughs> that this feeble art is all an oaf like me may offer you. Don't say that. It's incredible. Thank you so much, Captain Sergei. You and I stand as equals. You may call me Sergei. Then you may call me Saray. Saray, I am loath to believe the Pope just abandoned his post on us. But I also sense that there may be another side to this unfortunate story. I understand. We'll find the Pope and come back with the truth. Godspeed. Speed of God. Rose, was it the scattered bones who found the information on the Pope? Maybe. Seeing where the church's money was going gave us a little hint. That's what I thought. You guys sure don't operate in the same way that the knights do. Of course not. An assassin's guild can't function without proper intel. Assassins, right. 
Here is your pass, Soray. Thank you. Our travel should be much easier now. I wish it were so, but we've received word that Byroclef Ridge, which leads to Gadotten, has been blocked by rock slides. We could have been on the ridge right now. If only we'd been a little bolder. Oh! oh my punchline! What's the plan? You'll have to go through Cambria Caverns, south of the Meadow of Triumph. An underground passage, huh? No problem. <laughs> That's your thing, isn't it? You bet it is. Huh, so I can go straight to whatever the fuck that I have to go to. Or I can go to this Cambria Caverns thing. Where is it, actually? I'm guessing that's it? Where's the lake? No? Hmm. I'm gonna guess that's it. But do I want to do that now or later? I guess I can go and check it out now. Or should I do that off stream? Or not stream, but recording. Probably do it off the recording. Can I just... How do I quick travel again? I don't remember. Fuck. Hmm. Okay, well there's an event right at the exit, so we might as well do that. Huh. A Hellion! Is it one of the Cardinal's guards? Saray, we have to trick the guard into thinking we're not here somehow. Did I do it? Kill you to use that head of yours? Sheesh. Fuck. You don't learn, do you? Okay. We made it. Think we lost the cardinal with that? I sure hope so. Food for thought. Ugh, I ate too much today. My stomach's all achy. Oh my. You shouldn't stuff yourself like that, Rose. By the way, I was curious. Can Seraphim get upset stomachs or gain weight? To say it in a fairy tale sort of way, your thoughts become reality. What's that supposed to mean? We won't gain weight from consuming calories, but we will from thinking, I'll gain weight if I eat this much. Whoa! So does that mean you'll be okay as long as you don't think like that? No. Denying the reality of things leads to malevolence. A seraph must not be detached from reality. So at the end of it all, you could say we're the same as humans. 
This is so confusing. Okay. Really? I can't travel anywhere there? Huh. Why can't I do that? That's so dumb. get out of here huh seems to be a uh, an event over there so we might as well check it out too the only reason I'm here is because I want to check out that cavern Wait, how much was it? Fine. I got my pipe back. <laughs> it's kind of dumb, but eh. Maybe it's a good thing to have it. Who knows? All right, it's let's see. Here, right? The caverns or whatever, I mean. Cambria Caverns. He said they were south of the Meadow of Triumph. Am I going the right way then? I want to go to that, but whatever. We'll skip it for now. Thanks for the food. jump over this. Lame! I think I'm going the right way. Should be going the right way. Haha. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. uh, I didn't mean to take a screenshot of that, but okay. That's cool, I guess. I don't know why it took a screenshot, actually. Hey, I'll fight you. Damn it. Let me hit you! Fuck you. Am I going the right way? 
Where does this lead? Oh wait, this may or may not lead to me getting my ass kicked. I don't know if this is the right one. I think it's the other one that I have to go to. We're gonna go to the other one. Oh, fuck. Fuck you. I don't fuck with you, bro. we can get through this way don't worry you sound pretty confident is it just a hunch no i can feel the wind <laughs> doesn't get much cooler than this there's nothing in the universe cooler than a secret passageway it's totally a maze of twisty little passages with exits galore to who knows totally where. accidentally like skipped the something of a waterfall or the bottom of an old abandoned well yes Nicleo gets it glad someone gets it because i don't I don't want to get it. <laughs> boys just love things like this. In this case, I don't know about boys so much as children, right? <laughs> All right. I want to thank everyone for watching. I'm going to upload this as one giant video. I'm sorry that you guys have been waiting for so long just to have me uh, upload just one video. But like I said, if I'm not motivated, I'm not going to do it. Um... Hopefully, this motivation that I have right now continues on. If not, I'll see you in the next video. Or, not if not, but anyways, hopefully it does. I'll see you in the next video, guys. I love you all very much. Please do like the video if you have enjoyed. Follow me on Twitter. And follow me on Twitch. All those links will be in the description below. Bye-bye.